The whole nation, including the island, is suffering from COVID-19. While at the same time, a local soju maker donates ethanol for disinfection and property owners reduce rent. The province has decided to cut local taxes for property owners who lend a helping hand. Joseph Kim reports. This is a soju manufacturing facility in Jeju. Diluted ethanol is being poured into the containers at the factory. The ethanol in the containers are not for making liquor, but for disinfection. Due to the increased demand for alcohol in dealing with COVID-19, they decided to donate the ethanol. The donated alcohol is a total of 5,000 liters, which is enough to make 6,000 bottles of soju. The use of alcohol for other purposes is strictly controlled by the tax authorities. But this time, they gave permission because the quarantine is a priority. Along with this, the so-called good landlord trend is also spreading. Starting with the Sogipo Mail Ole Market Merchant Association, the number of landlords who have joined the movement of lowering rent is increasing, and Jeju Province said it will actively support them. Jeju Province said that for the landlords who lower rental fees, it will exempt or reduce property taxes, local resource facility taxes, and local education taxes for July. Property taxes and local resource taxes are reduced by the rate of rent reduction, and local education taxes are automatically reduced to a 20% surtax. To revise the exemption ordinance, the Jeju provincial government will go through a pre-announcement of legislation and call a special meeting to vote in May. A series of generous donations are warming up the local community, frozen by the cold wave of COVID-19. Joseph Kim, KCTV.